under the bus here. However, I have distanced myself and I will say that since I have, um, since I have just kind of turned a new chapter, I would say it's just a little lighter. Things are lighter and it's good. Uh, and I'm just trying not to focus on what a hard month this is. Um, just not letting that control my everyday. It's not going to steal my peace and, um, the people that are involved. I've spoken to several of them and I will just say that it's, um, it's, it's just something I'm working on. I'll just say that internally. Um, but my joy comes from the Lord comes for everyone wondering what this is about. People were asking her in her comments about her and Katie's friendship. And it sounds like she's dissolved that. She did stop following KJ on Twitter and Instagram. And I'll just let you listen to the rest of it. Comes from the friends that I have, my true friends and my true girlfriends that I just will tell anything to. And they love me no matter what, you know. Um, and they live in Arkansas. And they once come in a day to see me. She's like, I got to go shopping, girl. Um, so I am just really blessed with some really good, genuine strong healthy people around me and I it's it's just so nice to have their support through it all um I will um I am very aware of who is in my life for the right reasons and so I love that um I just have people that I can rely on in my life it's just really important 35 like I'm a mama. I love my life and I love the people in it. And I don't have to worry about what other people say because I feel like true colors will come out and I'm just going to be me. So that's okay. Uh, for all the things I'm so happy you walked away. Well, sometimes it's good to walk away. It's good to just clean your hands and say, I've tried my best and that's okay. You. no truly like thank you I feel like God gave me some thick skin because he knew I would be a part of some craziness so it sounds like Amy has seen Katie's true colors